everybody. If you're just joining me, this is Victor Blanco. I know you can't say, see me, but I want to keep the camera pointed towards uh, what's going on up here. I'm at the Odessa Synergy. That's the one right here uh, off of Highway 191. And there is a huge police presence. You can see we've got police, uh, we've got fire department, DPS, everybody's out here responding to a second active shooter. They're asking everyone to stay indoors. Do not come out here. You can see there is a line of cars against the, the street here because they cannot get through um, as that, this is still a very active scene. Um, so again, if you're just joining us, there is a second shooter, an active shooter here at Synergy in Odessa that the police are responding to. They're asking everyone to stay in their homes. Uh, we are on lockdown until the situation is handled. Again, this is the second shooter. There's also one headed from Odessa to Midland. Uh, I'm, I'm going to get as close as I can here for you guys, but again, they're not letting us very close uh, as this is still an active situation here. Looks like they may be pushing people back here. Let's see. Again, if you're just joining us, this is here at the Synergy in Odessa. We are not sure exactly what's happening. Um, we do have rep more reporters headed to the area. We'll, we'll try and get as much information for you guys as we possibly can. But at the moment, all we know, this is the second shooter. Uh, the first shooter was reported headed from Odessa to Midland in a gold car. Uh, they're asking everyone to stay indoors. And this here is the second shooter. Again, this one is at the Synergy in Odessa. Uh, if you are in the area or even if you are uh, headed out and you don't need to go anywhere, uh, look at right here I'm seeing, okay, I'm seeing the, the mail van that they that they uh, reported earlier. It looks like the mail van is down. So we do not have any word yet on who is in there. And this is about as close as they're gonna let us get here. Okay, everyone, again, I, I, I'm not sure of the situation. Uh, as we did report earlier, one of the, the shooters was reported to be in this van that you're seeing here now. Uh, I'm not seeing anybody or any other things here on the floor, but the mail van is there. You can see, you gotta, you can see that we still have the uh, police out here responding to everything. Are you in the news? This van. Was one of them down that mailbox? Yes, ma'am. One of them uh, reportedly was in there, but I don't see anybody, so that's all I really got right now. Yeah, so. uh, okay. You don't know how many it was? No, ma'am. As far as we know right now, we're tracking two shooters. So they had gotten out of them? No, he's, he was headed back towards okay. Midland. Okay. okay, we're being pushed backwards. We're going to have to scoot back a little bit uh, to a safer distance. And again, we'll keep sending out as much information as we can, but at this time, the area is on lockdown and we're asking everyone to stay indoors, do not leave your home, uh, as we're responding to this active shooter situation. Um, again, that appears to be the mail van right there that the shooter was reported to be driving, so I'm not sure where the, 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 um, the man was that was inside, but it appears that the police do have this area. Um, surrounded i'm not sure exactly again what is happening all that i uh, i have uh we were gonna ask the police there but we got pushed back is that car part of it yeah apparently this was uh the second shooter that was reported today he grabbed this van and was driving around i, I don't i don't see him though so i don't know where the one in the mail truck, the one they i'm i'm not sure i, I don't have any information at the, at the he was moment driving the white van or the black uh, traverse Chevy? The, the mail van, the actual white oh, one. he was there. driving that one? So that guy, he was driving this mail truck right there. The shooter. He was driving the mail truck. All right, guys, I don't have any other updates for you at this time. Again, we do have reporters headed to the scene here. Um, it appears that one shooter may have uh, been 
kind of pushed over here by the police, but I don't see them, and they did push us back, so there's no telling yet uh, as to what's going on, but we will continue to send you updates. So keep up with News West 9 on Facebook, Twitter. Uh, we'll be sending uh, pushes through our app, and of course we'll be cutting into t uh, programming as necessary. So uh, stay tuned any, any way you can, and we'll continue to keep you updated.